Yeah! Yo, I just got the greatest news ever. My drum kit has finally arrived here in Memphis. We're gonna go pick it up right now. Guess what? What? My drum kit has finally arrived. Are you serious? I'm playing Clash Royale right now in my pajamas at 1 p.m. I'm gonna go pick them up right now. I get to play my drums. Ooh, ooh. All right, so for those of you who don't remember, or maybe you're just not familiar with the channel, that's okay. I respect you and your father. I flew all the way to Taiwan, the other side of the world, to hand make these drums. I had very specific details that I wanted. I wanted ultra thin maple shells. I wanted this sexy neo mint green looking color. And as for the snare drum, I'll be the first one to tell you, I'm not an expert when it comes to crafting drums. So all I said was, hey, I want something that's super sensitive and super responsive, but can also cut your head off. So they did in fact create a six and a half by 14 artisan maple snare drum but they also mix in a bit of poplar into that maple for that super articulate sensitive responsiveness and i'm just so excited to go play on it and the timing works out perfectly because tonight we have our very first show with my band everything yes aka the album release concert is basically like nerdy jazz fusion music i love it these very special drums are getting delivered by one of my favorite humans in the world jim uting y'all know jim by now jim is delivering these drums to the memphis drum shop and then after the gig i'm gonna be able to take them home baby i'm so excited <laughs> sneak peek because that finish treatment won't be available to 20 until 2024. Oh, there's only one in the world. Whoa. She's all set up, ready to play tonight. think about the drum kit man i love it yeah. sounds great you like the uh the color yeah uh, yeah that's one of my favorite colors the wait seriously mint green like seafoam green really my favorite. dude you should check it out i love the 20 inch kick drum <laughs> A lot of body. Uh, yeah, have a lot of body. I guess it's because of the the thin shell. Yeah. A lot of warmth. Dude, you're a great player, man. Oh, thanks. That's Carl, guys. <laughs> That's Carl. If you haven't met Carl yet, the snare drum. When I was um, talking about what I wanted to have in a snare drum, was just something like really sensitive. Mm -hmm. you know, That's really sensitive. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of the the way I play, there's just a shit ton of ghost notes. Yeah, yeah. So like, I love how sensitive the drum feels mm -hmm. in response to those ghost notes. To achieve that, they had to put a mix of maple and I think poplar and like you can really just crank it up too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because poplar is like a really soft wood. Mm -hmm. You can't make a sh drum shell out of poplar because it's going to be so soft. Yeah, so they reinforce it with maple. Yeah. So you get a little bit of that poplar sound blended with the maple. That was like one crank on each lug. <laughs> I haven't even touched the bottom head. How much like snare I'm hearing even when I'm playing. Mm -hmm. I love that. Shit.
And it sounds so good in this room. That's true. This room is sick. Yeah, wait till it's mic'd up. Wait till it's mic'd up. <laughs> yeah. And we're gonna play um, our band's first show tonight in this room at the MDS soundstage. It's gonna be awesome, I can't wait. Oh, speaking of our, my band and our first show, we actually have a festival that we're gonna open up for in Santa Cruz, California, called the Church of Stank Festival. And the cool thing about that is also another fellow Memphian, Mono Neon, is gonna be performing at that festival as well, as well as Kiefer, Lawrence, and a bunch of other bands. But we can't make that happen unless the Kickstarter campaign, campaign, bleh, unless Compa the- Campaign? Campaign. <laughs> <laughs> we can't make that festival happen unless the Kickstarter campaign succeeds. So if you guys go to the link in my bio, please help us make this festival happen. Everything, yes, we would be thrilled to open up the festival for you all. Go to that Kickstarter link com campaign and I hope to see you there. Ah, dude, the thing just... I'm gonna sit all the way back there and I want you to like play the shit out of there. I'm gonna see if it slaps me in the face. I'm in the corner. Look at us, man. A couple of drum nerds just playing some drums. For real though, honest thoughts. Cause I'm thinking about this is gonna be my bat. Like I'm gonna take this one on the road with me, you know? It's nice. I mean, uh, you know, I heard him uh, playing around on this thing. Yeah, the, the snare drum, like, cause you play really articulate. Mm -hmm. um, the snare drum just like really suits your play style. Oh, thanks um, man. <clears throat> it's bright and crisp. Uh, yeah, I tend to play a little bit more like beefy, mm -hmm. warmer drums. But this one here, I mean, this probably has a lot of beef too with the thin shell. He yeah. just too cranks the thin up. <laughs> yeah, I do, cr I do be yeah. cranking it. <laughs> like, you know, the when you do the, the little press rolls and all that, man, yeah. it sounds so nice. Thanks, dude. gonna sound like mic'd up and playing in front of a crowd. All right guys, sorry for the super short video today, but I gotta go pick up my guys and we have a show to do here tonight on the new drums. I'm so, I'm so excited to play them drums. I'll see you and for those of you coming to the show tonight, I love you. The cool thing about this show, Memphis Drum Shop, Carl and his boys, they have like a full filming crew. So we're gonna have that crispy audio, that crispy video, and I'm gonna upload those videos of our album release concert here too, and you could check them out on the Memphis Drum Shop channel as well. It's gonna be a great time. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, uh, Carl was really uncomfortable. <laughs> At the same time, I'm like doing a whole uh, band first album release concert vlog style type of video. That probably won't be ready till later in the week, but for now, I'll upload this video. All right, I'll see you guys on the next one. <laughs>